Right, so this is about the water circulation in this unit. I had a video where I started and no water was coming out, and this is a rundown of how the water circulation system works. I have the lower unit off right now. I'm in the process of putting it back on. But, just for demonstration, we have this little shaft right here. Slips into the water pump, shoves water up into the upper unit. The water comes out right here. If you need to check where the water is, we're going to check right here. Pull this hose off either here or here, and that's where the water should come out. This is what I believe to be the fuel pump. There may also be a water pump in here. I'm not sure I didn't have to dig that deep into it. Water will run from there, up through here, and out this side, and into this unit. I'm pretty sure this is a water pump, but we're just going to call it a unit. Because into this unit, and then into the water jacket of the engine, all the way across. This plate here is the other side of the water jacket. So if you're having water come in, but not come out, you need to take this plate off and look at the inside and see what's in there. When you go do that, there is a gasket material in there, so be prepared to replace a gasket on that. Once it's done, water comes back out here. There's a tube, wraps around, spits out water right there. That's it. It takes about 30 to 40 seconds for water to start coming out of this. So if you know water is coming out of this unit, you know water is getting to the engine, whether it's coming out of the pee hole or not. And that's the water system in a nutshell. So if you need more advice, feel free to ask. I'll be happy to help. Thanks, guys.